Hello and welcome to Faster Than Light. Now, we have a bit of an issue I've just noticed. We've only got one fuel left and I'm pretty beaten up, so I'm going to have to go to this one, which is... Well, actually, I'm going to have to go to this point and hope that I can get some fuel. Please tell me I can get some fuel from these guys, otherwise we're in trouble. Now, we're being attacked by... Being attacked by the uh, drones. So, I'm going to direct my fire. Now, they do have a super shield, which is not good. Probably focus all fire on the shields, first of all, see if we can take that out. Then we want to deal with that drone. Let's see how much damage we can do. We took out the super shield, we just got to take out the regular shields now. Okay. So, my pilot just leveled in skill again, so we actually have 42% evade, which is really good. Uh, so, the pike beam will not damage through a shield, so I need to control that manually and only use it when I know the shields are down. Otherwise it's wasted. There we go, their ship's down. We got some fuel, we got some scrap. That works out well. Uh, we've got a distress beacon and a store. Let's hit the distress then we'll go up to the store, see if there's anything, anything we can buy. Oh, intruders. Two of them. So I'm going to have my lads go down there. I'll keep what you call it in the shield, in the uh... Okay, it's going to be Mullet and Joel, I think, for this little fight. Burst lasers, we want to get on the shields, take them out as soon as possible. And then we'll have the pipe beam ready to go. They already got their shield up. Let's just wait a minute. Mullet! Get to your post, man! Repel the inv invaders! Alright, Ferry, you're gonna have to join them because we don't want Joel getting his ass kicked. Okay, everything's offline. Pay attention, shame on me. Oh, they just abandoned the ship. Joel, heal up mate, mullet you too, ferry, you're good, get back on post. Let's wipe these guys out, there we go. Oh, I didn't get any fuel that time, but I got a lot of scrap. And we're headed, we're about to head to a... Let's get that repaired. We're about to head to a store anyway, so I'll be able to buy fuel, and I'll be able to repair my hull. Although I'm worried that Repairing my uh, ship's going to use up all my scrap, but then again, there's no point having like fancy items if you have no ship because it's been blown up with you on board, you know. So let's uh, make the jump to. I was just going to say, make the jump to faster than light, but that doesn't really work, does it? Okay, what do they have? Ooh, there's some nice, nice weapons here. Fix all, we need to. That had to happen. Hull beam. Now I could get the hull beam, but I don't. F no, we don't need it. Now we do have a defense drone to sell. Anything else? Nope. We'll keep the missile launcher, we might need it. But uh, everything else we'll keep as is. Now, let's have a look at this. Again, my engines are getting increased. You know, they're doing good. I could get the last last uh, points in shields, but I don't know yet. I probably need to upgrade my door system just so... 
Yeah, I probably should get some of these basic upgrades. The reason for that is because if I upgrade to blast doors, then if there's any fire, it won't spread. Or if there's intruders, it will take them longer to destroy the doors. You know, that's very useful. And this, if I need to pull the pilot out for any reason, I'll keep some of my evasion. You know, my evasion. I won't lose it all. And that's only 20, so that's not too bad. Although, no, I'll hold off on the invasion because I always plan on having someone in the pilot's chair. So, let's go ahead and upgrade the reactor, give us a bit more power. Just, just as a precaution, because I plan on upgrading my weapons one more time, so I at least have my missile launcher online all the time. I'm mostly preparing for the final boss fight, which is pretty tough, so... Now, ooh, we've got another store here. I should have checked the map first. Shame on me. Oh, and I... Hull missile. Nothing I really want here, to be totally honest with you. I could get someone from a ship, but... I could have had a slug. <laughs> no, we'll get some more fuel though. Right, let's get out of here. Okay, what do they have? They don't have any teleportation device, so they can't get on my ship. They do have drones though, so we need to get rid of them. They only have two shields, so let's say we go for their shields first. I'll be ready to use the pipe beam. In fact, we'll only shoot the shields once, just see what happens. Oh, I just put the... Oh, our weapons went offline. That's why. They're trying to escape. Mullet met the repairs. Now we can take them out before they leave. Yep, there we go. That wasn't too bad. Okay, we have fires. We have fires. That's not good. Luckily enough. We have the blast doors now, so what we'll do, we'll get them to go and repair bay. We'll open up all the doors. Get rid of that fire. And as soon as the fire's gone out, we'll get them in there to repair. Okay, it stopped burning, so let's close everything up. Give it a second, because if we go in there, they'll start getting damaged due to lack of oxygen. If you give it a little while, then you give a chance for oxygen to fill the room. So... There we go. We're making repairs nicely. I'm gonna have Joel... Well, I might as well keep him there to repair. No rush. Yeah, I'm going to leave Mullet over here because there seems to be more to repair over here if anything goes wrong. So, let's jump down to there and then we'll head straight north. Okay, let's take out their shields. And we'll direct where we want the pipe beam to go. As soon as everything is powered up. Ah, uh, bugger, the shields went up just before I had a chance. There you go, nice, nice and simple. Okay, let's make it to the exit, get away from this place. Quick look at what sector we'll be uh, heading to next week. What's going on? I could give him some fuel. 
I've got plenty to spare. Oh, they didn't give me anything in return. Oh, buggers. Oh well. Let's go to the Mantis control section. Are there any stores next to us? Yes, yes indeed there is. There's two. Okay, let's check them out. Cloaking. Ah, oh, ha ha, ha ha. We could get cloaking. Do we want cloaking? Hmm. It would be very helpful if we did have cloaking, but. And a hull smasher if I wanted to do extra damage to their hulls, but the thing is, is the biggest issues I have is oh, trying to get through. Ooh, a burst laser. We could get an extra burst laser. Yeah, uh, crew teleporter. I don't really have anyone to send across. Cloaking would be a good one, but I can't afford it, so... Alright, well, we'll leave it at that. Just buy one fuel there. A couple of fuel. Just so we don't run out, you know. Now let's make the jump to the other store. Make our way there anyway. Oh, Mantis, and they do have. So they're going to be hopping on the ship. So they've got free shields, so we do need to take their shields down as quickly as possible. Uh, let me get mullet ready. Okay, we want mullet to come up here, and I think I'm going to pull in. They only have lasers, so. But just to be safe, let's get Pomeroy. So I was worried about taking Pomeroy off the engine so the uh, evade chance drops a little bit, but I think we'll be okay. Okay, their shield is almost down. Can I get that done in time? We need to pull these two out. I think we'll send Joel in with Ferry. Lads have them. Okay, they've just escaped. And the ship's gone. That was fine. <laughs> Don't know why they'd made the jump. They just teleported on just to be either blown up or sucked out into space and suffocated to death. I think I'd rather have gone down with the ship. Okay, just get everyone healed up. I think we're doing pretty good at the moment. So can I actually upgrade my weapons? Because I was wanting to do this. It's going to cost a lot, and it seems like an awful lot just to get my missile on the line, but I'm hoping that ultimately it's going to be worth it. So let's make the jump again. And keep in mind, I'm playing this on easy, so... Oh, they have teleporters as well. Sods. Let's see if we can get the uh, missile launcher straight in there, eh? Okay, we need... See, what I would do is open all the airlocks and just let them suffocate to death. The only problem is, because they're going to go for the door straight away, it means the doors are going to be forced open, so... Not much I can do about that. Okay, that is done. Let's go ahead and take that out. Turn off the missiles for the moment. one. Okay, we've got, ooh, we want to go to the store first, so let's do that, because we can still hit the distress beacon before the uh, rebels catch up to us. At least I hope so. <sighs> Stealth weapons. Oh, okay, that's good. Uh, that's only good if I'm 
if I've got a stealth generator, which I currently do not, so... I don't know. Do I think I'm going to get a stealth generator? How many more sectors do I have left? No, I'll, I'll leave it. I'd be better to get like uh, another weapon of some sort that just takes two power slots to power, so I'll do that. Maybe another burst laser and have like four burst lasers going. That'd be fun. Alright, we do want to help him at the distress, distress location, so let's head there. Let's make the jump. I hear there's a lot in the way of modding for this game, so... If anyone has any suggestions for good mods for Fast and Light, you know, let me know and I'll uh, definitely give them a go. But here we go, we've arrived at the location. Oh, I thought, for some reason I thought leading them to their destruction. I was like, why would I do that? Is someone following them? Is that who I need to lead to their destruction? But, uh, okay. Okay, so we just got to get them to their quest point. Yeah, we could do that. Since they've just paid us. We better go straight there, though. I'm not going to go a long way. Oh. Borders, a lot of them. Okay, everyone. We need everyone for this. Hell, I'll pull the pilot out as well. To replace the person that's going to be uh, going to the med bay in a moment. Joel. You get in there, Adnan. Pomeroy, you're going to have to back out too, mate. In fact, everyone get out. Go heal. Oh, I should have just done this to begin with. Cruel, but I love it. Oh, I need improved doors if they're going down this quick. Alright, fair, you know what to do, mate. Oop, close the doors, close the doors, poor fairy. Let's get everyone back to their positions. Mullet, go get healed, mate. You too, fairy. Okay, so that went well. But I do need to upgrade my doors, I reckon. Um, it's going to be 50 to do that. So, so it. Let's do it. Hopefully it will help. Because, I mean, if I have the doors max maxed, if it takes longer for them to destroy it, then perhaps I can starve them of oxygen. You know, that would possibly work. Okay, let's make the jump. We're going to go straight to the quest area, as I was saying, so... Oh, they've got borders as well. Okay, so they've come to this room. I may as well try and fight them a little bit. Set my burst lasers on their shields, because they do have a lot of shields here. Same with my missile launcher. fire there so that was good. Oh this is much better now that we have um, Yeah that works so much better. I 
upgrading those doors was definitely worth it, especially if you get borders like that. Oh, let's get out of here. <laughs> Before we get set on fire again. Oh, they're offering me something to repair. Well, I could get a drone control and hook up uh, an anti-ship drone, because they are damn useful, but do I really want to do that? I already have a system repair droid. Okay. Okay, yeah, 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 let's do that. Okay, let's have a look. Um, so, ooh, <laughs> I don't think I've got enough to power it though, that's the problem. Uh, ba -ba -ba, drone control. So, at the very least, I could power on if I shut down, like, uh, So if I took that offline and sent my med bait for when we're, you know, we're not needing it, I could power on my either system repair or my anti-ship. And basically that will just, yeah, that will work, that will work, I like that. Okay, so let's make the jump. Oh dear. This is where it gets tricky because we're going to have to go fight for all the rebels. Can't be helped now. Okay, so ooh, they got a lot of weapons there, and they're gonna teleport onto our ship. Okay, we're gonna send the enemy drone to go out there and do as much damage as possible. I want burst lasers on their shields. We've got to take their shields offline, and the pike beam will be standing by until needed. Let's see where they board the ship. Okay, so they've boarded there. Why don't we just go ahead and get rid of all the oxygen in that room? It's working nicely. Look at their health drop. Oh, what was that? That was a nasty attack. Okay, mullet mate, you're on. Get in there, show him who's boss. Just exited the room. Uh oh. Need to pay attention to what's going on in the ship here. I wasn't really looking, I was busy doing this. Always pause often. Okay, so their ship is in a very bad state. They've got fires everywhere, that is fantastic. My anti ship drone is just doing damage continuously. My burst laser is probably going to finish them off here, but it's going to go for the weapons just in case so they can't get off any more shots. Um, I'm going to starve the shield room of oxygen, get rid of the fires, then we're going to lock all the doors up and get everything repaired. The hull breach I'll repair after this fight. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, I forgot we haven't got... Take one power out of... My evade chance. Okay, let's get, get everyone healed and repaired first. Close all the doors. Everyone go repair the weapons room. That'll give time for oxygen to refill on the shield room. Okay, this will work pretty well. Then we'll get them all to go heal up. So is everyone doing on the repairing front? Fairy's almost got a point in repairing. Okay. We have to be careful with that. I definitely need to invest in more power. Okay, let's get out of here. I believe we can make it to the exit without fighting the rebels. Nope. We still have to fight the rebels, fair enough. They've just boarded the ship as well. And they're going for door control. 
I probably don't want to starve oxygen from those rooms, so... Ferry and mullet Europe. Now let's direct burst fire to... In fact, we want the anti-ship up as well. Their shields have to go. Nice, we start to fire there. Okay, let's go heal up. Here we go, that worked really well. And we should be safe to jump here in a moment. I'm just making sure everyone is healed. Pomeroy needs healing. He took a bit of a beating in the engine room. Okay. Let's get out of this sector. We've had too many close calls. We do need to repair our hull. Oh, we're getting close to the end there. Slug controlled or engine controlled? I don't really want to go through another nebula, so let's go to the engine controlled sector. Okay. We arrive safely. My ship's still intact thereabouts. It's armed to the teeth now, that's for sure. I do need to get more scrap to repair my hull and upgrade my power, but apart from that everything seems to be good. Anyway that's it for now, thank you for watching, join me next time.